What's up? The Wi-Fi's dwindling. What you got going on? God. Uh, sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. All them damn singing alongs got me getting crazy. Peggy! What's good, boo? Yeah! Come on. Damn, Peggy. Drinking and driving will change your whole world. The next time you're out with your friends, consider what will happen if you get pulled over after drinking. Like the legal fees or time in court or a DUI on your record. Your decision to drink and drive can impact someone else's world too. If you hurt or kill them in a crash. Instead, what if your decision to call a sober driver could impact your world for the better? Drive sober or get pulled over. Paid for by NHTSA. <laughs> and that's the only time a machine could go come off. <laughs> What's good, boo? Yeah. No cap. Shout out to Mashika. Man. How you doing, Peggy? Man, I'm doing good, man. We're just trying to catch up with you, boo. I know you had a long weekend, a long week. You know what I'm saying? I heard you was on Nightcap that came to Buckhead Theater. Yeah. You popped out, yeah. showed out. Yeah. Like Boo could and Boo yeah. would. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? They, you know, uh, uh, shout out to my dog, Marquise. You feel <laughs> what I'm saying? He don't like me calling that. But my boy put me on a, a slogan. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. He said, uh, you can't expect or you can't be mad when it's too much when you ask to eat. Mm. Marquise! Drop top queen. Uh, he, 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 he gonna drop that top. Yeah, he man. gonna drop that top. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, like one more time for the people in the back. You can't ask or say that it's too much when you ask to eat. Mm. So yeah, we was, we had a uh, politic with Unk and mm -hmm. uh, Ocho. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Then we took our talents to LA. Yeah, yeah. Hold on YouTube. before LA. Hold on before you went to LA. Then we fantasy football. Okay. That's uh, Smoky Style. Yeah. Smoky Style. You Smoky. know what I'm saying? Had a real good time. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Uh, Sun football game this weekend. Okay. You know, they split them up because one of them had a game in Alabama. The team quit in the fourth. They ain't even. Yeah, they beat him so bad. Was true. Uh, Chosen had a pick. Yes, sir. Had a touchdown, too. You see what I'm saying? The chosen one. We locked in. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh, what future say? Life's good. <laughs> yeah, me. You know, so I ain't got, what about you, Peggy? What the man, fuck was you on? Man, we over here set jetting with, with, with Boog, man. I know you was talking about you had just went to uh, L.A. Mm -hmm. for the fantasy, fantasy draft Sunday ticket and all. So that was good. I mean, this your first time doing fantasy. Yeah. You, you a fantasy uh, uh, phenom Vet. now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Battery. Yeah. 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 You know, you know, one fantasy, my first round pick was Amin Ross St. Brown. It's probably one of my favorite receivers, probably one of my favorite players in the league right now. Okay, uh, I just like everything how he plays. And I, uh, shout out to his dad, bro, two time Mr. Universe, mm -hmm. uh, Mr. John Brown. Okay, um, the content that they're doing, what is it, the St. Brown podcast? Okay, it's so informative from a parent's perspective, and I just appreciate him just being a, a, a resource because the reality of where we are in society is we don't all have the answers. Mm -hmm. You know how to answer, yeah, Sway. got the answers. So when you have podcasts or people giving their perspective on different things, it just gives you more insight. Yeah. And, uh, you know, Mr. Brown is just doing a good job using his platform to inform and educate parents about his transition. He got three sons in the NFL, Yeah. you know. I would love to talk to Bosa's dad. I would love to talk to Ed McCaffrey, mm -hmm. uh, guys, uh, the Watt family. Yeah. Um, you know, I've always, you know, wanted to to speak to the parents, you know, in my situation as well. But, um, yeah, so from Nightcap Live, you know, yeah. they came and politic with me at Fellowship after. Fellowship. Shout out to Fellowship. And for those, it's, it's not Fellowship. Nobody okay. says Fellowship. At least not in the South. 
Yeah, it's like it's one of them things where fellowship, F E L L A S H I P, is the way you say it, and that's the way we spell it. Okay. And that's where you know the after party was, and it was it was real good, man. Just a bunch of like minds having a good time, unraveling. Um, got this opportunity to see uh, Shannon's big brother Sterling Sharp. Oh yeah, Sterling. Uh, it was it was a very star studded event, man, and. Um, yeah, we we was locked in all weekend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, now we're back, we're back on track, boo. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. And, and, and one thing that I found out, what's up? Can't have one, <laughs> gotta have three. <laughs> this train gonna keep <laughs> on rolling. Oh yeah, thank God, life gonna keep on going. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, shout out to Dr. Bryant. Though. Okay. Oh, no, I got to say that. You got we, to? We, we okay. have to. I didn't know where he was going. Hold on. I knew it was but I got to go. I have to say this. Come on then, boo. Uh, Dr. Cheyenne, Miss Bryant, uh, appreciate you. Mm -hmm. You know that. Um, appreciate the, the accountability. Uh, but most of all, appreciate you uh, for your insight and perspective. Okay. Now, some of it was true some of it was not all of it was opinionated correct okay now i'm gonna tell you what she did what she do she allowed all these people to have they two cents yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. to put into my piggy bank <laughs> baby, <laughs> I mean. listen baby if you better don't bring that sour shit over here let me tell you something because we good uh, uh huh you know uh my girl talk about uh what did you just do? I said, well, what, you, what you talking about? Because every time you do something, a lot of people just start to, you know, message me and do all this. What did you just do? I said, baby, I'm just over here doing what I'm supposed to do. Huh? And that's just to shake up the pie. You dig what I'm saying? Let them think what they going to think, baby, because they going to think anyway. Yeah. People try to give me insight that ain't even in or have never been in a relationship. Mm. Let's stop that right there. Mm -hmm. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't go to no uh, uh, first timer for advice. No, I don't do that. <laughs> Why would I do that? But Dr. Brian. The boy's still shaking. He, listen, I'm trying to tell Listen, at the end of the day, that was an amazing interview. And if you have not, please go to Funky Friday or, you know, look at the view. Watch the full show the full at show. that. Don't just go off the clip. Watch oh, the full yeah. show. Because it's, it's a lot of clips that's been going on. <laughs> and Peggy, we already done. <laughs> we don't really. Let, let, let's rev back <laughs> on. Uh, it's okay. Are, you're over the line now. Next clip. Let's see what we got.